guys, this is Fine Like Wine 49, and it's been a while, so I figured why not throw up another video. It is that late on Wednesday, I believe. Whatever. I haven't been playing this game for a while, so I figured why not just record something. I've been playing that KOF lately. Hopefully I won't be too rusty. I lost my, uh, I lost right after I stopped recording last time. Tried to get a few more points in the last time I uploaded a Let's Play. And <laughs> it's like Blackjack, you keep trying to go back and win more. Oh well, Cody again. Oh, he's just walking. Like a boss. It's annoying when they do that little slide because it really messes Guile up. It's a lot of attacks that he does. Here he jump. Oh, lagging! I don't know, maybe it helped me. No. Lag does not help Guile. Contrary to popular belief. Because you'll be uh, throwing out pokes and they'll come out late in the lag and they'll get beat by other, other attacks. He's gonna do like a desperate ultra, I would wager, at some point. Try to get a super going. No, I didn't have enough. Uh, I don't know what he was doing there, he just kept jumping at me. Down Pierce. I've noticed there's been a lot of Akuma players lately because uh, Akuma won Evo Infiltration. Which, that's fine with me. I, I mean. Usually, people who pick up Kuma don't know what they're doing, so it's free wins for me. Nefleros. When Cody's doing that little slide, he's got to be sort of... If you're up close, you got to spam crouching short. If you're farther away, you got to do focus, backdash, or whip punish with crouching forwards, that kind of thing. The tiny slides are really annoying. <laughs> Now, I really don't want to underestimate this guy because you could lose half your health in one combo, and I've lost to many low ranked evil Ryu players just because I do something stupid, so I just need to stay calm. Uh, sweeps unsafe on blocks just like normal Ryu. Uh, don't want to do anything too stupid. And I'm going to keep crouch checking until he punishes it. That's what I usually do against newer players or people I haven't played before. Alright, he's getting in a pretty consistent rhythm with jumping. So I need to. He's gonna jump here pretty soon. No. Usually I'll look for that. Oh, come on! I had meter to cancel it. That's unsafe, unblock. Jump! Come on! Oh dear. Getting too close for comfort. Yeah. I probably should have followed that in case he did teleport out of the way, but whatever. Whatever. Yeah. I think I'm just getting too predictable with Sonic Booms is the problem, not him predictable jumping. That dive kick will really mess you up, you need to stay out of that range. I thought he'd do another dive kick, but messed up the trajectory there. That is such a good focus attack. Could have supered, but it wouldn't have done that much damage, so... Keep it safe. He jumped way too late there. Yeah, he was kind of dangerous for not having much points. He didn't get that bread and butter combo in on me though. Yeah, if you get poked or like hit a couple times and then you get hit with that combo, you'll most certainly get stunned. Oh, creepy chair. I was checking to see if my cat was outside. Quite a few matches going on for uh, 10 at night. 
ultimate cat. Yeah, so I'll probably be doing another tutorial coming up uh, within next week, so why don't you just, you guys vote on whoever you want to see in the next tutorial in the comment section below. No! No, not Abel! Oh. Abel, Chun-Li, and Adon online are so difficult to play play against because you cannot you can, usually you can react to certain moves and hit it with a flash kick but online it's really hard so if he does too many wheel kicks I won't be able to do much about it need to turtle him very well here yeah I just need to keep a bunch of sonic booms going before he does too many of those I thought for sure he'd jump there. Wow. I'm usually right about that. I don't think this guy knows what he's doing, but I'll still be careful. Alright, I'll stop crouch checking then. Because he did punish a crouch check. He did do it in a block string, but he still punished one, so. It's lagging. That's a ch that was a safe jump in to chip damage. He was dead when I air throwed him. So if you get that setup down really good and they have a little bit of life left, you already killed him with that chip damage combo. And block stun. Real kick! Real kick! Whoa! Get away! No! Is he gonna roll? Oh, he might have got it. Ah, oh, it missed. He's too far away. <laughs> that sucks. Whatever, I didn't need the meter anyway. Yeah, what I should've done was just super him. And he got another one, that's dope. Let me uh, I tried to hit it when he was coming at me, but whatever. So that doesn't work, guys. Don't try that. Experimentation. Yeah, it doesn't work in Street Fighter Cross Tekken either. You can just smash out low attacks. <laughs> they do it too much, and you just gotta grab. What was his name? I, I don't want to play him again. His name was Clark. Okay, Clark. You work on that able. I I admire able players. Able's a fun character to use. No, it's Clark again. Oh shit. Okay. No. I said there was a lot of matches. Maybe I didn't know what I was talking about. There's that evil Ryu player. I remember him. Toro kill. Ugh. Yeah, I've been goofing off lately. I have no excuse. I've been playing. <laughs> I've been playing KOF, and then. It when I really have free time, I've been playing Skyrim, so... It's not too many tournaments in my near future, so I goof off. I think I tried playing him, then I got kicked out, but it worked this time. Green bar, go! Honda! If I lose to Honda, which it's entirely possible, but it'll be embarrassing if I do. Nah, he's got a lot of player points. So if I don't get my punishes on his headbutts and his butt slams, if he's gonna decide to spam it, then I'll lose. You can turtle him pretty easily, one of the easiest characters to turtle against, but if you start miss missing punishes, then it's gonna be uh, bad news. Yeah, I figured that'd come out. I don't know why I back this. I'm getting steamrolled now! Wow. Surprised he didn't do another butt slam. I tried to, I should have focused attacked, I tried to down fierce, but he did the little one. Okay, my backs are on the ropes now. Trying to do the same thing he tried last opening. 
Oh wow! Uh oh, this is getting too close. Too close for comfort. Oh, he's getting the super now. No! Oh, shit! No! Oh, like I said, I missed the punish. I missed the punish for the butt slam. He would have lost. Oh, my God. Oh, that sucks. Wait, I'm playing him again. Screw that. Oh, it's harder to do online, too. Where is he? That would not have happened offline. What was his name again? Oh, ultimate cap. Come on, go. That bastard! God! Unbelievable! I lost to a Honda! I know that match so well, too! He would walk forward a lot and then jump in, which worked on me the first round, but then I caught on and started punishing it the second round, but one of his jump-ins, I didn't punish it with the jump fears. For some reason, his fears beat my fears. Oh, that sucks. Oh my god. I guess he's in another match. Martin, whatever, whatever. Gotta move on. Could have come back in the first round, too. I think that butt slam in the first round was gonna miss. I could have just whiff punished it instead of trying to punish it, interrupting it with a down fear. Wow. Honda is like my number one match that I'm good at too, and I screwed everything up. Oh my god. Unbelievable. I'm just gonna steamroll this guy because I don't think he can. Usually, low point players don't have good defense, so. So I try to rush him down, and if they, if they're able to stop me, then I'll turtle, but. Oh, wow. Normal Shoryuken, huh? I just wanted to go quick. Quick matches. Damn it. That's gonna bug me for like the whole night. Man, Evil Ryu players love that focus, don't they? Here, I'm gonna... If he does it again, I'm gonna nail him the X Sonic Boom. Oh, now he's catching on. He's tired of me rushing him down. Oh, what? <laughs> that goes so far, that focus attack. Please work. Yes. So you can punish the jab, sure you can with an ultra. Good to know. Lost to a Honda. It wasn't even his main character either. Unbelievable. Let the Honda get too close, and then I couldn't punish the butt slam. Ah. There he is. Come on, I need to redeem myself. Okay. He's probably not going to use Honda because it's a bad match. Okay, good. So, what I've noticed, he likes to walk forward and then walk forward a long way and then jump in with Fierce. So, I need to be ready for that and he was he only did one Ochio last time and I jumped every time in his block string and I got beat by Jab Hands. So, I'm going to try to block more if he does get close again. Back up a little bit in case he jumps. Oh my, I backed up! I packed up and he still hit me. Oh my god. I'm getting mad now. He 
And you almost hit me too. That's what I was trying to do last time at the end there. Okay, Jump Fierce didn't come out, I guess. That was Ultra. That was Ultra. That was Ultra. And he does like to walk forward a lot, then jump, so I like to backfist him when he's walking forward. And I tried to fierce him when he switched sides. It's a bad habit of mine. It just doesn't work. I don't know why I do that. Bad habit. He's at a perfect angle for me to do the uh, down forward roundhouse. And I tried... I, I'm doing so many bad habits right now. God. Oh, I couldn't cancel it. He was too far away. Ha <laughs> ha. He went wild and crazy at me on the end. At the end there. I'm still mad that I lost to him, though. <sighs> Frustrating. Uh, should I play him again? I don't know, he's... It's pretty much, like... <laughs> he pretty much kind of randoms it out. Kind of. He, lots of unsafe things that he does sometimes work, and then he gets a knockdown. Try one more time. It's pretty dangerous trying to play this guy again. Because <sighs> he likes to jump and he likes to headbutt and butt slam. Okay. You know, I'm not surprised that he plays Zangief. He's a gamble heavy character. And I made a tutorial on Zangief, so hopefully I, uh, hopefully I can beat this guy. <clears throat> Embarrass me on my own Let's Play. It's Honda. Is he gonna jump uh, around house? Jump Fierce, I mean. Wow, that back fist goes so far. He just likes to jump. He is very jump happy. I'm surprised he doesn't have a Ultra 2. I knew he'd jump. Oh, I fierced! I shouldn't have fierced, I should have jabbed. Hopefully this will punish him. Oh, that was close. All right, I gave him a set. I'm done with him. Let's see what time are we at. Uh, I don't know what time we're at. Um, uh, we'll do one more. Screw it. And if it's not a good match, and then I'll just cut it off with some scrubby uh, Ken player or something. But, uh, yeah, so vote for that new tutorial, the new character you want to see, and I will do my best to upload it before next weekend. Here's hoping I'll go out on a win, though. It's someone who's good. Ugh, drinking my beer here. Very unprofessional. No, I don't want to play him again. He's done. Done with him, William Stryker. Isn't... Isn't that a striker's name in Mortal Kombat? Oh, that was... No, that's from X-Men. What the hell am I talking about? William Stryker, the... Oh, no! It's Guy! <laughs> oh, shit. Shit soup. Okay. Hopefully he's elbow drop happy. Cause then I could trip guard it with low attacks, and guy players, they're not used to people punishing it. Oh, he's sliding a lot, you dirty bastard. Alright, I'm gonna do more focuses, 
because he's sliding a lot. Like that. Let's use a combo. Air grab him. I'm gonna chip damage him. Oh, he pressed the button. He would have died no matter what, even if he altered, because that's a safe jump in. Back throw, and then as soon as you can, on the first frame that you fall, you do a down pierce, and then you jump right away, and there's nothing that he can do. And you could also option select it, so in case he back dashes. Wow, that was, that was a bad play on my part. Ignore that, people. And I'm going to keep trying to cross him up, get him to waste some meter. Well, he's not ex tattooing at all. Alright, and that is my Wednesday night at Street Fighter. But yeah, that chip damage, I believe I, uh, I talked about it in a tutorial of mine. But anyway, do the... If you catch him in the air with a back throw, and then down fierce as soon as you can, then jump forward as soon as you can, you could do a roundhouse, and then a crouching strong, and then a flash kick, and you could chip damage them for 28 more damage, so it's a... And if you have a super, you can link a super to that too. So yeah, hopefully this helped you guys, and be sure to vote on the next character for my next tutorial that will be hopefully coming out next week. Okay, thanks for watching guys.